Hello, this is Chris. Hey, it's Chris Igo with Remax. I'm giving you a call. I noticed your property listing was canceled in the MLS. I was curious, how on earth did the property not sell? I'm sorry? Yep, I'm here. I didn't, I didn't, I didn't hear what you said. Oh, yeah. No, yeah, no, I was giving you a call. Are you the owner of Martin Circle and Royal Palm? Is that you? That's correct, yes. Outstanding. Okay, great. Yeah, I noticed that your property listing was canceled in the MLS. I was curious, how on earth did the property not sell? No, it's, it's not being, well, basically we're taking it from one uh, one source to another. It's going back on the MLS on Monday. Oh, okay. That, that's it, all. It is, it, is going, it, is going, it is on the market right now. Oh, okay. So are you getting a lot of phone calls from realtors? Because it's actually coming up as a canceled listing as of last night. Uh, no, we're not getting any calls from realtors. The three weeks we had it on, sir, uh, on the MLS, no, uh, we only had one realtor call. Oh, wow. Okay. Did you have any offers on the property while it was listed? No. Mm, okay. Uh, there are three reasons I found why properties don't sell, and you probably know all of them. The first one is price. The second is the condition of the property, and third is the, the way the property is marketed. Now, you mentioned you didn't have any success uh, originally. The person that you chose to, to go forward with on Monday, is it the same person? No, it's a, it's a different company altogether. Okay, now have you signed with them or you're going to? I'm going to. Okay. Would it offend you if I ran a property analysis as it relates to price and emailed it to you? This way we're both fluent and speaking the same language as it relates to price. You sure can, but the problem is uh, one of the reasons that I, it was listed as a flat fee MLS. Yeah. And uh, I'm, one of the reasons I didn't want to, to use a seller's realtor is that uh, you, basically you guys charge too much. Right. Well, let me ask you this. Commission. Well, look, nobody wants to pay commission. I get that. But but let me ask you this. If no, you, I, have no problem pay, I have no problem paying commission. I just don't play, believe in paying inflated commission rates. Sure. So let me ask you this. If you knew absolutely for certain that by doing business with me, two things would happen. One, the property would sell. Two, you would end up with significantly more money, bottom line, than you could get any other way. Now, I know that's a big promise, but would you at least want to hear more about it? Be honest. I listen to you, but I just don't believe if you're going to sell my house at the current at the current marketing price, it should be it should be set at. We'd be actually uh, receiving less money. Yeah. So so here's what I'd like to do if it meets with your approval. And, and just so you know, I'm with Remax Direct. We've got six offices down here in South Florida. We've sold fifteen thousand homes since two thousand and eight. We're averaging one a day. I'd like to lay eyes on your property and see if it's something we believe we can get you multiple offers on and sell fast. Do you have availability tomorrow afternoon to, to for me to lay eyes on the property? Uh, no, tomorrow. I'm gonna, we're going to be gone all day tomorrow till probably 5 o'clock. Okay. Well, I think it is imperative that you don't sign with anyone until you meet with me because I know that I can net you more than any other method. Um, I have a 2 o'clock appointment this afternoon, um, do you have availability, say, 4.30 or 5? Uh, no, I've got to go back to work. I'm available on all day up till about uh, 4.30. Mm, okay. Uh, let's see here. It is... Next day, uh, next day I'm off is Monday. Okay. And so... Uh, 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 basically, Monday, Monday morning, we're going back on the MLS again. Yeah, but if you haven't signed with anybody, I would encourage you to not make a decision until you've... You, I think it's important that you make the best decision for you with all the information possible. So, And I, I know that we do business completely different. So what if we were to do this? Um, I've got a 2 o'clock appointment in Boca. Uh, it is 8.30 now. I could meet you uh, 10, I could meet you at 10.30 at the property if you're there. Yeah, I'll be here. Outstanding. All right. So here's what I'm going to do in the interim. The number that I called you on is your uh, cell phone, correct? That's correct, yes. Okay. I will text you my contact information so that you have it. If you would, just save it in your phone. Um, that would be fantastic. And I will meet. Now, let me ask you, if when we meet, I can fully demonstrate to you that my pro approach and method will net you more than any other method, is there any reason you would not be able to sign with me when we meet? 
I'll listen to you. I just don't. I don't think. I don't understand that. I don't see how you can with your with the realtors' commission rates. How you can uh, get me more than. Uh, well, I, I'll tell you how we specialize in, in finding the one buyer out there that's willing to pay more than anybody else on planet earth. And, and I'll be happy to go into that in great detail, how we use uh, analytics and a variety of other methods to, to get your marketing in front of people who are looking for properties exactly like yours. And I know that's not, yeah, I mean, I, I, you can, I have no problem you come out and listen, but the part of the problem is if I overprice the product to cover your commission rates, then you're going to get less buyers right. the, the, at the home won't meet the appraisal rate. Hundred percent. So that's why it's important that we meet, and I debunk everything that you that you think is uh, is is holding you back. But I can tell you this: I'll never let commission stand in the way of us doing business. There's a reason why we've sold fifteen thousand homes since two thousand and eight, and I look forward to showing that to you this afternoon, or excuse me, this morning when we meet. So I will see you today at ten thirty. All right. No problem, sir. All right. Have a great day, and I'll see you soon. Okay. Bye. There you go. That's how you do it.